Christ, Dad. I mean, did you did you make a fucking wish with a wizard? I mean, what the hell's going on? Make a wish with a wizard. You know, the wizards are always white haired. I don't know. <laughs> oh my God! You We're shall not fun. pass. You know, just fell into a volcano and made me. Here we go. You're gonna age immediately, son. But you'll be able to sing for a couple years. <laughs> but by the time you have the confidence to do it, your chin will be gone. And no girls will care. Tits by the armpits. Tits by the armpits. <laughs> Welcome to the Lion's Den. I'm Brent Morin, and we're keeping all that in. Hey, fuck yeah. Tits by the armpits. Tits by the armpits. <laughs> um, I'm Brent Morin. This is Jason Collings. Make sure to rate and review. You guys oh, haven't God. been doing it. It's pissing me the fuck off. And Jason, take it from here, because okay. I forgot. We're, we're going to start over again. Nope. Why? We're keeping no, all this in. Good. We're keeping <laughs> all this in. No, we're in. keeping it in, but yeah, yeah, I'm going yeah, 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 to do the go. plug. Action. All right. okay. Action. Action. Jason. Take action. Three. Two. <laughs> God, we're bad at this. Why Welcome back. Action. Welcome say, back to the Lions Den. Look at, look at. Welcome back to the Lions Den podcast. Please Toddler. continue to rate and review at Apple Podcasts, iHeart, Spotify, wherever you listen. Leave us a five star rating and a review, and it'll help us, help us, help us. If you want to look at us while you're listening to us, go to YouTube, the Lions Den with Brent Moore and Jason Collings, and we also have a YouTube's clip channel, Lions Den Clips. And for all your members only content, hey, oh, I didn't, for, I forgot to say, on YouTube, mm -hmm. like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell Bing. so you know what's coming at you. And for all your members only content, go to patreon.com slash the lion's den pod. That is patreon.com slash the lion's pod. You also for, said YouTubes and that made me happy. With the YouTube. S at the end? Yep, made YouTube's. me happy. Okay, made cool. me happy. YouTubes and the, ex YouTube's and the social medias. Uh, and for one, one stop shot lion's den, go to the lion's den pod.com. Hey guys, I'm still a little high. Are you? Because I think I am. Wait, do dates first before we talk about that. Okay, Ooh, do I, dates oh. first. Ooh, look who thinks they're in fucking charge. Or don't. Hey, don't care. Oh my God, you he don't? has changed. We'll oh, talk look about at, it. He just did the Dalia don't care. Yeah, well, that's true. But uh, well, you're, well, you're the one wearing this Dalia shirt. <laughs> well, he's one of my whoops. best friends. I don't apologize. I love the color. It's a good color. Uh, it good brings color. out your eyes. Yeah, yeah. He sends it to me. He is so desperate for me. <laughs> um... <laughs> Uh, yeah, I actually think I'm still stoned. I forgot yesterday was 420. Which and, is ridiculous. And I was with all my stoner friends at a show. And but so, also, let's not act like it's a fucking holiday. Yeah. We live in Southern California. Rich. On stage last night, I was like, 420. And it was like, woo. And I go, you guys know we can do this every yeah, day, yeah, right? it's not <laughs> any different than it's normal. Different. <laughs> it's not different. We could do this shit our like, day. Yeah. We could do it outside. You could give the peace sign to a cop while you're smoking. I'll be honest with you, uh, for once. Uh, I hate when people say that. Can I tell you the truth? I'm like, you never did. What, what you have know? you been telling me? <laughs> so yesterday I was doing a show with our, our friend of the pod, uh, Rick Glassman, and uh, we went outside to take a picture of the marquee because he, he was being cute and he wanted to take a of photo. Of course. He can't hate this. And uh, Was his, his face on it? or? Yeah, it was. But you know, they have the, uh, with Bray Improv, which beautiful club. Go if you're in yeah. that area. Uh, but uh, they have the electronic one, so it's yeah. daytime, so we can't see it. I said, well, we'll wait till night so we can get a photo of it. But was his, multiple was his people- on it? No, no, okay, but multiple checking. people stopped by, and, he, you know, it's cute. It's the first time he's dealing with some fanfare, mm -hmm. kind of, for, like, Rick Glassman, Rick. But the funniest thing, it's the middle of the afternoon, because we got there early as shit, like 5.30, oh, wow. and the, he would be like, oh, thanks, man, can I get a photo? Yeah, yeah. Do you want you want some weed? And, and so by the six perks, and they're going like, no, no, I'm good. And one person's like, yeah, I'll take one, you know, and I, I said, <laughs> Rick, stop. Like offering drugs to people on a public <laughs> sidewalk. <laughs> and he goes, I don't know what to do. Because <laughs> he was sponsored by this this edible company. And I go, stop feeding your fans. Cool Oof. sponsor, though. Yeah, hey, it's really cool. Uh, last night sponsor. I did edible mints. I have to tell him that now. Edible mints. I did breath mints with yeah. CBD in it. CBD oh, or that's good. THC? Teas, whatever the, the one CBD that makes you go. Back? Uh, oh, THC, THC then. <laughs> yeah, the one that, THC, Indica Couch, Indica. Yeah, wow. you're, no, that's all right. You're all you're right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's just a weird way to get there because you yeah. have like, THC in the couch. It's like Michael Scott oh, in the office, way, yeah. the way he would get around remembering people's name. <laughs> yeah, in so the I did in that. The couch. I did that. I had smoked a little bit. They, of course, at the Ha Ha Comedy Club, they we had no. they were giving us fucking <laughs> these pre rolls that were great. Oh, that's cool. And yeah, it was, oh, was it like a special like four twenty show where they were like yeah, you know, which was so that's ridiculous. fucking cool. It was ridiculous. 
Because we can do it every day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that is true. Yeah, yeah. Every day in no one's stopping you. In California. Ooh, well, people ooh. are doing it so much in California that literally to somebody that are a fan of, they're turning it down. Like, no, I'm good, man. I'm gonna, <laughs> <laughs> we're going to go get dinner, then we'll that, smoke it, then we'll come to the so show. Yeah. Uh, I'm doing Molly tonight. It's like so basically relax. passing out cigarettes now in California. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> are you it's doing Molly funny. tonight? Uh, no. I, w- I would. It's on my list. Do it with me. Hi, Mom. <laughs> <laughs> do it with I'll me. I'll be safe. Uh, do it with you? What, just two guys hanging out and doing Molly together? Yeah, three. Who I else? would do it again. Oh, all of us. Oh, just do a podcast mm. on Molly. That would be the longest podcast, <laughs> and it would be... And, or the shortest. We would feel like this has been nine hours, yeah. nine minutes. You'd be surprised. It will feel like nine minutes, and it'll be nine days. And then I'll be like, no, I love you, man. And then we'll just <laughs> be like, did I, did I tell you guys about the thing with the... It's like, yeah, man, but that's fine. Keep going. <laughs> it really is that feeling. It's an unbelievable drug. It's not drugs. Well, it's a plant. My favorite thing Wait, ever. We, we're talking about weed? N- we, oh, were you talking about Molly? Yeah. Molly. Oh, Molly's yeah. a drug. Yeah. No, you're right with the nine minutes. Where worst, you'll yeah. feel like it's worst, nine hours, but it's worst nine minutes. Worst fucking dare counselor ever. No, but Molly, Molly will make <laughs> Molly you. Molly will make you feel. Go ahead. My favorite thing ever was my old roommate uh, who's big in all the drugs, and I hadn't done any of them, and I would ask questions to him. And I'll never forget. It was like the worst dad ever. I would go... Uh, Hey, uh, what's Coke like? And he would go, and he would pause. It was always video gaming. You know him. I know Zach. who we're talking about. And then he'll, I shouldn't say his name, but uh, pause the game. He'd go like, just a second, guys, because he's always playing <laughs> with people. And he goes, Brent, you don't want to do that. And I go, why? What does it feel like? First off, you feel like a million bucks. Second, nope. you can you control everything. Hmm. Every idea you have is perfect. Hmm. You're like a lion in life. And then he goes back to the game. sounds good. Yes. And that's how I go, that's not helping me. So then I go, uh, I'm with my cousin. I I go, uh, hey, Zach, what's up, Molly like? Hang on a second, guys. Pause it. And he goes, Brian, you don't want to do Molly. Okay. Mind you, the people go, on hold are all 14 and under. Yeah, all 14 and under. He goes, I go, why? He goes, well, first off, you feel like a million bucks. <laughs> Second, everything you touch is the greatest. Masturbation is better than any sex you've ever had. Honestly, a pillow is the greatest girlfriend you ever had in your life. And he goes back to gaming, and I'll be like, Zach, what is acid like? Hang on a second. First off, you feel like a million bucks. So he keeps going through the drugs. And at this time, he was clean from drugs. And then by the last drug, he goes, Listen, if you want to do it, then we'll do it together. And I realize, <laughs> just by asking him, I go, is this the worst advice <laughs> yeah. you ever you can't say You say all that and then don't do it. <laughs> you can't yeah, fucking... You can't. So you shouldn't do any of the things I said are the most beautiful things in yeah, the entire well, I, world. I want to do them. Do you want to feel amazing? Do you want to <laughs> yeah. feel incredible? Do you want to feel like you are an orgasm? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But the convincing of himself to why did I stop doing this, <laughs> maybe I should do it again, to hang on a second, guys. I know you have homework. Um, <laughs> I'll do it with you. <laughs> All right, let's do it. I love hang on a second, guys. Hang on a second, guys. Yeah. Brent. One second, guys. Don't start without me. Hang on, Tyler. One second. Yeah. Listen. Don't scrimmage without me. Um, <laughs> whatever they do in those war games. But yeah, uh, that would be a fun pod. Speaking of weed, so this made me think of Mike Tyson, because Mike Tyson has his own weed oh, company, yeah. Tyson Ranch, by the way. Oh, I yeah. had some. Not bad. Really? Oh, yeah. oh, nice. Yeah, I did a show with him for that was sponsored. Me and Russell Peters did a show. Was at the uh, Anaheim, the Grove of Anaheim. We did a show there. The Grove. So it's so fancy. And his yeah. the his, Grove of Anaheim. The Grove of Anaheim. And his company, his weed company, was one of the sponsors. And he was there, and he came out on stage. But anyways, did you see what Mr. Mikey Tyson did on the airplane? Oh yeah. No. I showed him. I showed him this video th- he got, today. He knocked somebody the fuck out on an airplane. Well, yeah. This. Uh, if we could post that video. He was totally in the right. It was yeah, just we'll, some we'll post rich... it right here. This is George talking to Mike Tyson, bro. This is crazy, bro. Mike Tyson. <laughs> My dog done got lit, man. He over here rapping with Tyson. Mike Tyson trying to give us some shrooms. <laughs> you don't know how to act. Tyson looking out, man. This shit crazy as fuck. He should have never gave you his money. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. Hey, Mike, Mike, come on. Let's go stop back. Let's go to the horse, man. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, Mike, Mike, come on. Let's go stop back. Jet Blue, man, flight. My boy just got beat up by Mike Tyson. Turn that way. Yeah, he got fucked up. Just trying to. Fucking what, what white happened? kid in first class, like basically poking a bear. 
So it's Tyson sitting in his seat. Yeah, yeah. They're in first class. It looks like JetBlue Mint. It's, that's what they said. They have the pods. Mint. They're in like a pod thing. This kid is standing up and talking Over to like him. Now you and it now. fucked up. And Tyson's not he moving. Was, he was fucked up. Oh yeah, my he was god! So drunk. Him and his buddy who's taping. Like, look at the fucking dog. I don't even think like that was Tyson. his buddy yeah. taping. No, he said it because he was like, "Look at my buddy." Talking. Oh, okay. Like, he goes talking to Mike Tyson. Look at and that. And he's talking dude. to him, and then next thing. And Tyson's ignoring, ignoring, ignoring. Trying. You know how you are on a plane. Mm-hmm. When you're not famous and people want to talk, you're like, would you Come on, shut man. the yeah. oh fuck God, up? The worst. I'm flying in here. And um, now you're Tyson, and everybody knows who you are. And you're in first class. By the way, first class, if you can afford it, is that's p- part, of what you, part of what you're paying for is privacy. Mm-hmm. One hundred percent away, away from the riffraff, as you would say. Yeah, yeah the well, riffraff. Don't, as I would say, as Brent would yeah, say, paint me this picture. No, uh, the, the king, the as fancy Brent, king of right. Brent. As Brent Warren, would say, away from the, the poor, poor Anaheim. piece of shit riffraff. <laughs> yeah. um, I no. just do this. And <laughs> walking by in your little pod. But during Can the, but during the taping, <laughs> but during the video, this guy's being like shitty. He's going, he's looking at the camera, and going, "You're a peasant, you peasants." Like he's like, the guy said that to Tyson. No, he was just saying it to the camera. Oh. But you, you oh, know, tell he, they're probably talking about the people in regular class or whatever. Mind you, the whole time Mike Tyson's not even looking at the guy. Next thing you know, the video I saw hmm. cut to. Yeah, it was a Tyson. Cut just to. didn't just punch him. Oh no, he was. Oh, Lay it over no and way. over, and, and then it cut to again, which in my opinion was fucking hilarious. Yeah, it was hilarious. Was the kid looking at <laughs> the kids looking at the camera with a sad face? Yeah, and, and he's, he's a drunk, sad face, fucked up, bleeding, yeah. scratched, and yeah. And then his buddy Whoa. taking the picture goes, "Man, I don't know what happened. He was just asking for his autograph. He wasn't fucking no, asking for his you autograph. Were, you were enticing him for you no reason. You were taunting him, Tyson, like Tyson, Brent was Tyson, saying. Tyson. You were poking the bear. You Damn. were kicking. Him. You were kicking the beehive. Good." You kick the beehive, you're gonna get stung. Fuck mm-hmm. yeah! And boy, did he like get that. stung. That's the wrong beehive. And I don't blame Mike at all. Yeah, all the comments didn't. Either. However, my fear: if I did something like that, am I on a no-fly list? Yeah. That's am I oh, arrested for sure? Imagine, am I kicked that's off crazy the plane? To do. So I want to know what plane. what the circumstances were afterwards. Like, me, what yeah, was do the, some research here? Yeah, yeah. Let's figure this out because I am curious what's gonna happen to Mike. From right. That. I'm also curious what the public is saying. Too. Also, <clears throat> here's the fucked up part: is I know these type of kids, these boarding school type children, mm-hmm. where now he has a story. He's awake and he's bleeding and he's drunk enough where it's numb. Right. You know. The next day, he's probably going to wake up like, what happened? Also, but you know, you don't think he's going to try to sue Mike That's Tyson? what I was going to say. That's what yeah. I'm getting to. Is then now he's going to be able to sue with poking him, and then Mike's probably going to have to pay, even though sometimes there needs to be frontier right. justice. And, and <laughs> I, I can't remember how long it's been since he's been out of prison. Yeah. But is there some sort of parole violation? Is that is that the time up for I that? I hope not, man. Is he going to get in extra trouble? But, but dude... With social media, the, though, what helps is that... Everybody has his back, and mm-hmm. it literally is. He's here's the thing, and we didn't see it on camera, and I don't know if we're going to or not. I think what happened is I I don't think that he just. I think the kid at some point made some sort of physical contact. I yeah, think I, he I got more details. He, here. Either oh, touched really? him or yeah. well, let I, me hear it. Let's hear yeah. it. So first of all, he says. Um, a witness told uh, Tyson took a selfie with the fan who was identified in the video as George, <laughs> and was patient. Fuck George <laughs> with him George. for quite so. And so Tyson was patient with him for quite a while while the man kept talking to him. Eventually, Tyson reportedly told the guy to relax. The passenger didn't stop his antics, according to the footage. And Tyson reacted by punching him several times. <laughs> well, it sounds like Tyson's shitty in that way. But here's so so um, it's really funny. Told him to relax, then beat the fucking shit out of him. <laughs> <laughs> told him to relax, so and he didn't relax. So he said. So this is the Tyson. Uh, con- Representatives for Tyson said, unfortunately, Mr. Tyson had an incident on a flight with an aggressive passenger who became began harassing him and threw a water bottle at him oh, while he was in his seat. You're, right. you're done. That's you're self-defense. Right. You're right. Now you're not just it, you, that, that you're using a weapon. Yeah. You've just made the water bottle a weapon. Have you ever been hit with a, a full water bottle? Yeah. If it's, if it's like a Suck. Fiji or something, that shit hurts. It, it, dude, Fiji's have corners. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's true. What I'm saying, bro, the cap, that shit's heavy. Dude, like that the corner of a Fiji smart water. Bottle, you oh, for square off a, a bottle and fill it with liquid. Concussion. Yeah, and you get that corner bro. in your temple. You get you're one done. of those, one of these fucking this boy with the metal. That's that's, <laughs> oh, well, a, murder. that's, that's, that's a murder. That's a murder chart. That's a murder. That's a deadly weapon. But you get that assault with a deadly weapon. That Starbucks smart water that looks like a propane tank that just hits you in the fucking head. Can I get a water? Thanks, guys. I have nowhere to put this. Are there any? <laughs> is, is there anything that he's going to have to deal? Here's with? Here's what we got. After so, the Federal Aviation Administration, ah, FDA, uh, the FDAA, FAA, FDA, 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 FDA is the meat. Uh, uh, FAA. They've, 
The meat are also have some mm-hmm. comments USDA, too. They sorry, say, no, as no, the USDA. meat industry, where we do not condone this <laughs> yeah, type of violence. Sorry, <laughs> but we didn't ask you, meat industry. Yeah. No, no listen, but we're, we're here. It's a very we, stone. We sentence. believe that you FDA. need our opinion. Uh, the USDA believes that Mike Tyson was done. Look, the, we should get burgers. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Since the acronyms are very close, we feel like we should offer a statement as well. Yeah. <laughs> Federal law prohibits airline passengers from assaulting other passengers or crew members. Damn. In addition, passengers are subject to civil penalties penalties, penalties yeah. for any misconduct that can threaten the safety of the flight by disrupting or distracting cabin crew from their safety duties. So it sounds like the first, it sounds like they may be referencing the water bottle first, but then it was like, it beats shit up. You're still going to have to pay for so it's gonna be. If you watch the video, he's laying into this guy over the seat, just multiple. Yeah. But yo, if you throw a Water bottle at me? Yeah, I'm on a no fly list because I'm gonna beat the shit out of you. Yeah, you don't. Or try that. if I yeah. can stand. You know what? Also, I but I wonder if the guy as he's getting beat up by Tyson is kind of like this is so cha-ching, cool. Cha-ching, that's cha-ching. the thing. His no, face no. after. Ching. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 It's like a video game. His yeah, face yeah. after is like getting paid. Oh, man, the rich get richer. Also kind of, I mean, what a fucking story too. What yeah. an ass. I got no. beat up by Mike, Mike Tyson, Tyson on a JetBlue jet Mint, oh, and he probably has no regrets. Fuck his fucking fault. That's so annoying. I it hope we can show that video, David. If you can find a way to show that, God, yeah, yeah, just cut here. For well, for our, if we can't show it for copyright shit, that's why it's not here. But if it's here, great. Yeah, but why wouldn't we be? Because I don't know. Otherwise, how the go look it up if we can. Rules work. Yeah, we don't know how yeah. the rules of the internet work. Yeah, so I thought that was. Uh... <sighs> can't wait till we travel. Cut to us, you know. <laughs> Jason beats up someone in yeah. a fucking. And I'm going, but it's like Jason, no, stop, stop, stop. <laughs> Jason, no. And it's like why is Brent sound like a Hispanic wife? No. And while Brent's holding me, their friends are hitting Brent, so he's just like Jason, yeah. Jason, Ow. 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 stop. <laughs> like why is Brent's nose like this? No. It's just I remember one video of, of a lifeguard getting in a fight, and some guy runs, and they go, Carl. Snow. Oh my you god. <laughs> Carlos, no. It's like, man, Brent looks so bad in this video. Jason looks badass. <laughs> and it's just this on TMZ. Dude, if I ever get in a fight on a plane, I don't know if I should even announce this here, but I'm gonna I'm gonna disguise it like I'm getting beat up. And nice. Like, and then just sneak shots in. You would you know be able I mean? to do that. That's yeah. the thing. I'd be like, just throwing peanuts. Oh. <laughs> On JetBlue, the, the blue Doritos, yeah. like Ninja Stars. <laughs> that can hurt. Oh, yeah. Oh, the tar oh, chips. Yeah. The yeah. chips. Yeah. I actually had a, a very small confrontation on a flight like a, two months ago, and I was the one Excuse who Excuse like, me, sir. That's my bucket. Like no, kind okay. of kind of a thing of it was it was a thing of like a girl in the front was uh it was I was like second row. Someone was in the front with like the, her. Or first of all, no shoes on, feet up on the wall. You know, oh, one of those people that. that you're Gross. like, what are you doing? You don't live here. Yeah. Gross. Ugh. And she had a and she had her she was watching something full volume, no headphones. What and an it was asshole. like it was like the aware the unawareness was like shocking. Yeah. And it was yeah. everyone or everyone around was doing the thing where they're going, where the where is this? What, who? And no one's. And she was right in front of me. I was, and I was like, I was. I was and the flight that attendant feeling, that heat. not yet. And I felt the heat being like, <sighs> the someone's got to say something. The, no one is. The bullshit I'm like, was rising up. But I'm yeah. right. I'm like the, one of the closest yeah. to her. So I was like, I could say something, but I was like, fuck. I was like, how do I? You know me with confrontation. Yeah. I'm not the guy to be nah, like, you're not. Listen, you know, you're, uh, excuse me. Yeah. Pardon? Uh, no, I'd, I'd, I'd go instead of that. I'd go, boing. It, yeah. Oh, you're which a rat. Is, which is you're actually, a fucking yeah, you rat. rat. But no, I, no. <laughs> what I did do, I said, I said, all right. And I stood up over the over the seat, and I was like, I was like, hey, excuse me. And she was like, hi. And I said, uh, do you have headphones? And she said, uh, no. And I said, oh, well, it's really loud. Nice. And she said, oh, I'm sorry. And I'm like, yeah. And I sat back down. Oh, okay. Well, that and you then made she it just kept doing it. It just sounded kind of okay. So you didn't was, ask no, her no. to turn it down. I said you a just mini pointed it out. A mini. I said, hey, just so you know. Well, first of all, the fact that I was like, do you have headphones? She said, no. I love that you didn't ask her to turn it down. No, I wanted first to go, hey, do you dummy, have headphones? do you have headphones? That's because fun. you're supposed to have yeah. them. And that's then you good. said, that's really loud. And yep. she goes, oh, she was like, oh, I'm sorry. And then did I turned she, it down. Oh, she turned it down. Yeah. Did, so she, did she keep her feet on the wall? Probably. Yeah. Oh, God, hippies. And then me, I get back to my seat. Like, Every time yeah. I sleep against the window... And lean on that wall. My yeah. first thought is, Ugh. how many feet have been on this fucking wall? Ooh, That's why I, you don't get those. Tell me that. Well, you wipe. We well, all yeah, wipe. You're right. I do. And wipe. there's something yeah. about that disinfectant smell that I really like. I'm like, am I in the hospital? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh my god. Dude. Where's my, my pudding? Back my heaven. Where's my apple, <laughs> Where's my apple? juice? <laughs> Hey, would you like any water or coffee? Can I just get a drip? Yeah. What? Can I get a morphine drip and an apple juice, please? Remember that time we we're on a plane? I just we're fed up because we travel so much. And yeah. one of my 
pet peeves is when you put a backpack in the overhead, especially on mm-hmm. a pack Fuck plane. Off. Remember, or you're a with jacket. Me. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Remember you're with me and yeah. I'm trying to put a bag. Go, Whose backpack is this? Oh man. Yeah. Nice. It's becoming me on the plane. <laughs> and, I, and I go, yeah, you put that under your seat. Nice. Because I'm like, don't do that. Yeah, because someone's got to check me, the fucking like, bag, probably. <laughs> oh, fuck yeah. <laughs> fuck yeah. Doing? This is Move great. Back. We're dude, traveling here. The flight yeah, home dude. from Philly. Okay, Philly was amazing, by the way. Thank you yeah. guys so much. Yeah, we had a by the blast. way, unbelievable. It was great yeah. seeing all of our Patreon friends. You guys were amazing. Thanks for the monsoon. We had, we had a monsoon. Oh, it was a monsoon? No, it, 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 Brent's well, exaggerating as usual. But um, <laughs> no, it, it fucking sounded like I'm on stage. Yeah. And it all of a sudden sounded like, Th- like thunder and rain on the because you you've been to Philly Punchline, nope. never oh, have. Oh, it's, oh, it's not like a. Cl- it's built like a, almost a warehouse. Mm. Yeah, really high ceiling. Was it good though? It was, it was great. great. But high ceiling, great are, club. It, it's a great yeah. club. Cool. But the rain was hitting the roof so hard that you <laughs> yeah. couldn't not point it out while wow. you're on stage. So like you're, everyone yeah. can hear it. Yeah. So you're anyways, what's we did have on? a monsoon. We had a blast in, in 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 Philly, and it was great. Flight home. I don't know how it was for you. But here's how it was for me. It was an evening flight. Mm-hmm. We took off at what seven thirty in the evening, yeah. and you get home at almost fucking midnight. Mm-hmm. So what are you gonna want to do on that flight? It's nighttime, lights are out. It's relaxing as shit. This fucking bitch next to me, <laughs> and I'm calling you that because you have no fucking self awareness, and you were yeah. the one. She was literally one of two people on a flight of four hundred people doing mm-hmm. this. What do you think she was doing? Full light. Full Big fucking light. reading light. Yep. The entire is, time. This is spirit too, so it's like school lighting. Uh, it's not like a... You could hear yeah. the light going... Yeah. It was loud. I thought, I thought a UFO. It's like an interrogation. But anyways, I kept going, and she's just... Then she would turn it off, and I was like, oh, thank God. And it would be off for a minute, minute and a half, and then she'd... Uh, finally, i go, it must be a great book. Oh, nice, nice. Nice. And she just ignored me. Ugh. I'm trying to think of like what okay, let's let's play her let's play devil's advocate with her with this with this. There's none. What's the like let's say she says, Okay, I really want to read a book on this flight. How do I read a book without disturbing the plane? Here's my here's thing. Here's what you don't I, no, no, no. here's here's uh, how it works. Don't. Right. No, but here's Or a, give it a time limit. Here's my thing to play devil's advocate. Yeah, I'm just trying to play what's the other side of that? Because I've been where it's don't like read. If I have to work, but everybody's asleep on a night flight, yeah. and I realize that that particular mm-hmm. light is too bright, or my laptop's too bright, I turn it down or turn it only because I have to work. So unless she's a book editor, and she now, has to read it for work, right? Then you should just respect the fact that nobody's no doing one else it. had it. Yeah, yeah. So don't buy do it. it or get a reading light or that you can put on your yeah, book. Yeah. a fucking tablet. Or yeah, Kindle or because whatever, the yeah. tablet itself lights up. Mm-hmm. You don't need the fucking sun beating down on us. Mm-hmm. Self awareness. You know what? You Zero self awareness. This was a six hour flight. Ugh. Yeah, six fucking hours. The entire time she's reading this book, and I'm also thinking, hey, you should fucking be done with it by now. Yeah, take a yeah. break too, right? Because the guy next to her was reading. He did it right. <laughs> he read it for a while. So then he's like, you know. That's enough. The plane was dark, except for us. Mm. We're lit up like the fucking 4th of July. He turns his light off and he takes a nap. She's reading the whole fucking time. Brutal. And she's in, and you're reading a book. We It's 2022. Do, what? I can, fu- read, I can read a book tops 30 minutes. But also, don't bring a book. Put it on a fucking tape. I mean, uh, on a tablet. Put it on a... <laughs> put it on a tape. What do you call it? The, the Amazon... Yeah. The Audible. Kindle. Kindle Audible. Or put it on Audible. Audible. Yeah, put Audible. it on Kindle. Yep, put it yep, on... Yep. But now you have a... Also, she had everything with her. Everything's under the yeah. chair. And there's so many... You get a fucking personal item, you get a carry-on. <laughs> and that's all you should fucking have. And personal items are personal fucking items. If it's it's not your backpack and then a sweater, a shawl, a scarf, a tote bag, a fucking <laughs> hat, a hat. You have everything with you, and it's all there and out. And it's like, I'm sorry, are you in a one woman play? People that bring, <laughs> it's crazy. Are, yeah, you're doing. What are you doing? You look like the wardrobe department. And it's amazing <laughs> how much shit people yeah, bring on a fucking yeah. plane. What? How much do you need? I, yeah, I don't yeah. understand. Ooh, I'm getting mad. How Sorry. Are Jay, we're traveling Sorry. tonight. Sorry. I know we're flying out tonight. Was it I'm a... ready to punch people? <laughs> what is I'm it about a... to Tyson these motherfuckers on the flight? You know what I just realized? What happened to your neck pillow? You haven't brought it on the last few ones. 
because of this thing I'm talking about. I feel like bringing too much shit on the plane oh. is annoying as fuck. But it you know what I mean? really compact with but it. But I'm wearing it, it on this one. Throughout the airport. Because I was thinking it. a sleep mask might help too. Because I, I have one of those too. Good call. I, one. I have good one call. of those and I have a weighted one. And oh, I never thought in a million years that on a night flight where everyone's on the same page except for this fucking idiot, <laughs> I'd have to wear a mask. I understand the, the mask, the sleep mask during the day. That makes sense. It's nighttime. Mm-hmm. You fucking psycho. It's nighttime. Plus, and with the, the worst masks. part, this woman was tiny, and I don't know why that made it worse for me. You <laughs> little bitch. I her legs, like, her legs were kicking like this oh, while she's reading. Like uh, Jesus Christ, are, is this tiny Tim learning Yo, to read? I wanted to look out the window. Yeah. To see, L.A. I love. Looking at the lights of, of LA flying yeah. in at night, yeah. and then you could see SoFi with the graphics on the roof. Yeah, and everything. Yeah, really yeah, cool. yeah, yeah, yeah. Couldn't see any of it because of the light. Because her fucking light glare. You just had to see. Your I fucking literally had eyes. tried it, and I was like, "Fuck it, you bitch." Oh man, was it a full flight? Oh, it was full to the gills. I was gonna say, could you theoretically like try to change seats no, or some shit like wouldn't that? Wouldn't work. Were you window? It really yes. was the only fucking. I gotta seat rethink the window thing too. Sometimes. Well, also, I, I'm not kidding. It, lights are different on certain planes. Spirit Airlines had public school lighting, because <laughs> no, I'm not because the this couple next to me because I was at window two and I was I was asleep for most of it, but then I was like uh, the uh, cart's coming, so I was trying to order something, but they're asleep, so I'm being very. Uh, Oh, we had such an aggressive like male flight attendant. He was just mm. an asshole. I get oh, it, dude. You're not hilarious. happy with your job. It's fine. Yeah. But I'm going, can I just get a, a water and a, and a cranberry juice? And he goes, what? And then I go, just a water and a cranberry juice. But then he did this. This is how I found out about the light. Then he goes and does that, turns the light on. All of us woke up, or they woke up, and I went. <laughs> like, it was why like did he the, turn your light on? Yeah, why? I don't know. He, he didn't punch turn. Him. I was like, I so, want to so accidentally to elbow him in the nuts. And then oh, he goes, shit, "What do you want?" And then the, they're up now, and they're this looking at me like it's my fault. And I go, "I didn't do this." Like, keep why in did mind, he turn it on to keep hear you better? Mind. I don't know. The brighter, keep the louder the sounds. Mind. Such an asshole. Fuck you, Spirit Airlines. That's what I was going to say. Seriously, keep in mind, fuck off. We were on Spirit. We were on a school bus in the sky. I hate Fucking. that place. Which, by the way, I have to do because all the. Pl- Flight. I'm so sorry, Jason. I really apologize. I, I know you've been on private planes and I you know, go everywhere. I know. And, and Will's going to leave us soon. But I <sighs> book what I can book. Bye, you <laughs> asshole. <laughs> it's like, okay, I guess I'm I... buying a dirt bike and I'm going to sit in spirit. That's Dude, <laughs> here's the thing about Spirit Airlines, and I'm calling you out, you fucking lying ass bullshit airline. Oh, yeah. You know, we have the lowest prices. No, you don't. No. But you don't because you got to pay for mm-hmm. every. Mm-hmm. You have mm-hmm. to pay for water. You got to pay for yeah, you water. Told me that. I didn't you got to pay for your carry-on. Yeah. You got to pay for, for your the, shoes. Your, everything. And then it's like <laughs> then when you book the ticket and already pay to get on the flight, when you check in, they you have to pick a seat, and it's another twenty five fucking dollars. It's brutal. crazy. It's yeah, like, brutal. um, sir, is anybody wearing bracelets? Well, this was a gift. It's like, okay, that's thirty bucks. <laughs> yeah. No, it's on me though. Okay, mm-hmm. cash, sir, are please? you limping? Cash. They cash, asked me if I was only. limping, and I says, yes, yeah, that's going to be a $65 charge. <laughs> we have a limp fee. Because we have a limp fee because you're slowing yeah. everything down. Yeah. Yeah. Any and glasses the on the plane. Best Jason's part? really going to shit. Yeah. No, no, no. no, no. I'm, Any LASIK? See. Fuck. Yeah. Damn it. No, no, he takes Everybody. His, he takes his glasses off. I can see fine. I don't have glasses yeah. at all. It's Looking like at church. The, it's I'm not at a window. <laughs> it's literally church with the fucking basket. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then the best part? The best part on a five-hour and 50-minute flight? Seat doesn't recline. Of course. None of the seats so on just, Spirit recline. I think it's they had back decent. Their first class seats look pretty decent. Yeah, but I mean, it's the fuck out of here. Now I can't recline. You can't watch. I, I can't have water for free. <laughs> be a dehydrated on. I can't get on ass. on the internet because that's a lie. They said it's yeah. there. I don't. I it's couldn't not figure out the fuck out. And I got Little Miss fucking Library over here <laughs> under a goddamn UFO spotlight <laughs> reading a book about bullshit. <laughs> I, I really wanted to was. be like I can't, I took a couple peeks over to see if it was like an academic, like she's studying for yeah, something. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That I would have got. I think it was like a fucking romance novel or, uh, or something. A novella. What if it? Okay, uh-huh. now let's play another situation. Let's say it was it was you know trigonometry. If she's uh, studying for something know, and it's and it's helping to her future, and she has it. to you're good. have like a you're good. I'm good. Yeah, I'm good. You're doing you, and that's you're the working point on of the you. Book editor thing. But she was reading a fucking romance bullshit thing. Just like this. As soon as I here's what I read when I peeked over. I read this. He walked <laughs> towards her slowly in the shadow of something, something. You know, it'd be hilarious if you couldn't stop reading it. You got and then I got all way in. But then, and then, then will I reach yeah. over and turn the page? <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah, sorry. Yeah. You turn on your light. <laughs> <laughs> we need more light. No, but then she does this. You're so bad. And then she goes. Ah. 
and you go, wait, 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 uh, and I don't know, man. I'm did a... you sleep with rage? Because then once I was like, well, at least we're landing at LAX oh, you at know midnight, I... so there won't be anybody there. Everybody's there. Oh, I guess it's God. Christmas. Sleep with rage? You know how I sleep hard? Yeah, dude. Yeah. Love this is me hard. sleeping like rage. Fuck! <laughs> Your heart's That's how I snore. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Fuck! Uh, did you guys have to wear masks? Because yes. now it's a thing. Now, because you kind of don't. We don't what? now. We don't? To, as of now, we don't. <laughs> so happy i don't have to do it anymore let me look it up it's like four the four major airlines All, a bunch of people are which are posting memes and tweets about it and shit i don't so I actually it. mind it when i'm I, sleeping i hate me. it I, I i get it too i can't but breathe also, you know the thing is i kind of need to it's hide also, my bullshit look, and it's not that i don't believe in masks like it's the fucking easter bunny or some shit it's i it's not that i don't think here's the thing on the plane it's not gonna fucking work yeah. We're in a fucking tube. We're, we're, we're literally in a Petri dish. Well, we're flying yeah. in a Petri dish. And then, this is what the flight attendant said. I wanted to punch her in the face so bad. She said, I'm not physically violent, but I could have been that day. She says, we require that you keep your mask over your nose and over your mouth at all times. And while you're eating, replace the mask yeah, yeah, between yeah. sips and bites. Those were the words. Mm -hmm. Please replace your mask between sips and bites. If I saw somebody on the plane going... <laughs> I'd be like, that's a serial killer. Yeah, just also, well, what the fuck? Are, are, like, like you're out, you're you're pace outpacing the virus. Like, well, well it's he, coming. Well, I'm gonna get it. Like, I don't understand it. It's well, none of it works. Here's how I I was trying to break this down get so much because of the the frust frustration. You remember in uh, two movies had this just to paint a picture for people at home, hmm. The Rock and Outbreak. Where the scientists get in the hazmat suits and they right. go into like this little bubble, right, to work yeah. on something. There's no moment in that bubble where all of a sudden they go, oh, "Can I get that water?" You know, <laughs> and then go, oh, "They're yeah. still gonna get whatever right. that is." That's the same shit it's with this. It's such bullshit. It's People like, are dumb as if you fuck. wear this, you're safe. But you could take it off while you're in the biohazard zone for a minute, right? You if know? you're gonna it force, listen, if you're gonna force me to wear a mask <laughs> on the flight the whole time, but then you're gonna have that weird little fucking food and drink rule, yeah. Just don't, don't have it. Don't don't either don't do the masks or don't serve food and drinks. Yeah, you know that thing they say like uh, at your own risk. Like you like you go to a go kart track or you go yeah. like uh, you know some shit where it goes like if you shoot your eye out at paintball. That's mm -hmm. all you need. We already took the risk going to an airport with right. those shitty bins and everything. It's like if you take the risk to come to this airport, we know what we signed. You up could for. wear a mask if you need to, but we signed up for this. We know what we signed up for. That's Just why have whenever that on they the say. Ticket. Whenever they say before their thing, they always say, and for your own safety, I'm like, you know what? For my own safety, I won't, f I wouldn't have flown. Yeah, yeah. yeah. For my own safety, I know what I'm signing up for. Yeah. And we I got it. Up for we this. got COVID on a plane. I got it all, baby. Kansas City, baby. Fuck yeah, it. baby. Kansas City. Yeah. Kansas City. Almost that. Almost that. Almost that. I like that. <laughs> I know. <laughs> what were you just singing? I said almost died. <laughs> <laughs> almost that, almost that, almost that, almost that in Kansas City. <laughs> oh fuck! Been watching the. Uh, it was a good rant. You watch the uh, the Johnny Depp trial at all, dude? Uh -uh. Have you seen any of this? Uh, I saw something with Poopy. That's all I saw. Oh my god! What? So oh, like, I saw a Poopy thing, and that's yeah. All one I, of her friends shit on the bed or something. Nice. God, it was so funny. This guy, man, I'm I'm watching it, and I feel so bad for him because he's sitting there like this the whole time, like pouting. <laughs> And Johnny Depp looks adorable when he pouts. I'm not going to lie. Great hair. I want to put, put my arms around him and tell him he's going to be okay. Also, he has great hair. Why does he wear so many fucking things on his head? Like, do you need a bandana, a beanie, <laughs> yeah. and a fucking fedora all at the same time? Like, he's, he's wearing everything. <laughs> he's like the guy on the fly. He thinks he's the pirate now. He thinks he's it's the like pirate. It's like a kid playing yeah. adult and yeah. just gets in the oh mom's God. closet. <laughs> he does you know? I'm wearing everything. Like. He does look like he's wearing all the things. <laughs> yeah. You know? but Mommy, look what I'm wearing. Dude, what were you doing in my sitting there. Closet? Some of the shit people are saying, it's just like, oh, this poor fucking guy. He got called an old fat guy. Oh, it was so funny. By who? Well, I guess that was in the depth. That was in the trial. It says yeah. here you were called an old fucking. No, fat they guy. were they were reading what they they were testifying as to things that she, she had said about him. Jesus, right? And then at one point, I feel like come on, guys. She had testified. <laughs> to, somebody testified that she had we told she had told them. Yeah, it's so boring there. It's just a bunch of. 
<laughs> yeah, it's so fine. boring at his house. It's just a bunch of old guys playing guitar, and it's on his face when he <laughs> when she says that, and he just goes like this. He goes. Like he's trying not to laugh, <laughs> not dude. To laugh. That's really funny, though. I, I, like, I love it's, Johnny Depp. It's Dad. comedy, bro. You gotta watch it. Okay. From what he wanted every, this trial. From what yes, everyone is to... saying, he's just a really sweet guy. <laughs> yeah. Sure. And he's and he was just he was he was Burkhart in it, man. He was really afraid of uh, uh, confrontation. confrontation. Sure. <laughs> Put it this way: he was so afraid of confrontation. This is how hard he Burkharted. Mm. This is how you're gonna be Burkhart when you get more money. He Burkharted to the point of. <laughs> He broke hard to the That's point so of this. Funny. Whenever they would go on vacation, he would have to get two hotel rooms because she would flip out so much. Oh no! That he'd be like, "I gotta go to the other oh, room." Oh no! Yeah, you're going. Oh, I gotta go. Yeah, I gotta go. the key's not working. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. And yeah. she's like, <laughs> she's pooping. She's pooping in the hallway. She's pooping in the hallway. So a friend of hers shit his bed. So they, they, there was a piece of shit in the bed. <laughs> like human God. shit. I don't think he did that to his own bed. Did I see this? <laughs> was there a picture? Did they show a picture of it? <laughs> I'm gonna look it up. No, now. there was a piece of shit. He I mean, was like, either she Johnny did Depp it or poop. a friend. Is, is it a big? Sense. Let me ask this: Is it a big shit? Hold on, hold on. Who, who also? I only saw an image of like. Is like the a, image the poopy in the middle? It's something That's, like out of always. I mean, this sunny. is a fucking comedy. I mean, it, it like, really what is, are we talking oh, it's about? Here? It's poopy right in the now, bed. It's my favorite. It's like an It's Always Sunny episode. I would love to see a transcript of some of my relationships. Oh my god! You know what? Fine. Trolls are real. Look, Brent says as he storms out of the house. I swear on hair in the wind. On several occasions, he looked like he was holding back a laugh. Oh, dude, with his with his friend from thirty years was trying to be nice, but. He was he was holding back laughs like this is hysterical to me. Yeah, yeah. So apparently, a bunch uh, of old guys playing guitar that would have made me laugh that would so hard. Make me die because like yeah, yeah, you're right. That's what we're doing. <laughs> and guess what? I'm Johnny Depp. I earned this. <laughs> yeah, I could that's be an why old I wear guy. so much jewelry. Yeah, that's why I wear so many scarves and hats and bandanas <laughs> and fedoras and those weird leather and cowboy you hats. All, you of all people should know. You can't tell if I'm fat because I'm wearing 19 layers. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> According to Depp, Heard blamed the fecal incident. Call it that. poopy. Call it poopy. God, I love the fe- on, dude. Uh, band on. name, fecal incident. Fe- there you go. Fuck. Yeah. Keep sending us band names. By the way, that's another thing we need to bring back. He blamed it on her dog. Uh, Heard blamed it on her dogs. An explanation Depp said he found ridiculous. They're teacup Yorkies. <laughs> <laughs> Hilarious. And it looked like somebody laid a baby arm on the bed, huh? God <laughs> damn. So, so here, here, let's keep going. So, uh, <laughs> she. She brought up. Uh, this is a quote. Uh, she brought up the fecal matter on the bed. She tried to blame it on her dogs. <laughs> Their teacup tea Yorkies, they weigh about four pounds each. And I lived with, was at about a, a I lived with those pounds. dogs. I picked up their funk. It was so cool to call it funk. funk. It was not the dogs. He later added in testimony. The source of the there we go. The source of the bed poop also came up in Depp's 2020 defamation trial in the UK against a British tabloid, which described Depp as a wife beater. Yeah, yeah. heard al- that's why he's silly. Heard yeah. alleged that Depp showed up late. Depp la- showed up late to a party, beat her, and then left. <laughs> Depp said that never happened, and he believed Heard was. Heard or one of her friends defecated in the bed. Hmm. Uh, Depp ultimately lost the UK case. The judge ruled that it was unlikely Heard or one of her friends pooped in the, on the bed. In fact, the judge said this uh, because it was Miss Heard who was likely to suffer from the feces on the bed, not him. Suffer, even though her? they had several apartments on the same floor. There was oh, evidence that's there. They're going back the to what I said. Had completely, you know, extra spots. So oh, get they away. say one of the dogs had. Incomplete mastery of her bowels after she had accidentally consumed to marijuana. She got the whitest ass or the widest asshole in the history no, of no, this is a dog. This is a do- That's yeah, what I'm yeah. saying. But this is also incomplete mastery of her bowels. Jeez. That has to be incomplete. If mastery I ever of her shit bowels. my pants, I'm 100 percent saying it's I like Mr. Hunt. I have incomplete mastery of my bowels. I'm sorry. I have incomplete mastery of my bowels. That's <laughs> oh now take me off this bed. I'm too short to jump. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's pictures of the poo in bed, dude. Really? Oh, put that up, David. It's in the middle of the fucking bed. Let me see. That's not a Yorkie poo. That's a person poo. I grew up and in that's two an Yorkies. incomplete person poo. They look like they pinched it off because maybe somebody was walking in the room. No, no, you do it. No, you know you do it. And I can picture them squatting over the bed. <laughs> and Johnny's coming. <laughs> Pinch it off oh. and get the fuck out of here. Yep. Looks like a half a shit. Is what it looks like. It looks like they were trying to grow a complete tail, yeah, yeah. but then had to fucking got a little tail bone. Yeah, had to get that fucking bone. get the little Frenchy tail, mm. little French bulldog tail. Yep. Mm-hmm. Got that mastery, incomplete mastery of bowels is Damn, dude. unbelievable. When she did that beating case years ago, like Johnny's ex wife and all ex girlfriends came forward saying he would never, never. Hit a and also, <laughs> thank God, that's great. Good, thank, good for him for suing because he lost, like he lost, oh, he lost a he lot lost of a shit, fantastic dude. beats movie and all that shit. All man. that stuff. He lost, he lost the um, 
he he so, lost the whole Caribbean thing. Yeah, he the lost pirate millions. thing, the pirate guy, the pirate dude. Yeah, that, uh, what that was Jack the pirate's guy? name? Sparrow? Jack Sparrow. Jack Sparrow. See, that's the thing. He thinks he's Jack Sparrow now. Oh, he's also, dude, Jack some Sparrow of the too. shit that she said to him was so fucking mean. When he got the Dior uh, oh, gig campaign, she got, he got the Dior campaign, and he was all proud and happy. And he goes to her and he says, "I got the Dior." She goes, well, "Why would they give that to you?" Wow, Oof. you're like an you're like an older fat guy. Jesus Christ. So it's like, uh, treat them like dirt, stick to them like mud or something. Isn't that like an old yeah. thing? I remember that from Trick. high school. Like, you got to treat them like dirt so they stick to you like mud. I Which, go, oh, yeah. by the way, hey, if hey, the girl, listen. Bryce, yeah. I don't think that's yeah. the way I want to talk well, to women. I, I think the better thing is treat them like dirt, shit on his bed. There you go, yeah, dude. Yeah, yeah. Treat him like dirt, shit on his bed, call him a fat guy that plays guitar. Yeah. <laughs> Girls, what do we always talk about? Treat him like dirt, stick to you like mud, shit the mud out, right on the bed, and then fat guy. Old fat guys, right? Old, old fat, fat guys, guys, right? Playing old fat guitar, guys. they're old, old fat guys. guys. <laughs> meeting, meeting, meeting starts, yay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, girls. So meeting who... adjourned. <laughs> Get out there and ruin some lives. Yeah, so Denise. <laughs> We, this is very exciting. Denise, we heard that you met somebody in Ibiza that owns a yacht company. So what are we going to say? I'm going to call him fat. Yeah, uh -huh. uh -huh. Make fun of his ex-wife. That's good. Mm -hmm. And then uh, he's been wearing this pinky ring. That's good. No, 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 no. Denise, Lori, remember that thing you said? No, she made a fortune on this guy. <laughs> um, <laughs> okay, meeting adjourned. Uh. See you Old fat guys. Remember? <laughs> Old fat guys. <laughs> Old fat guys. Yeah, 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 fat guys. Oh, okay. And remember, no degrees. Okay. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. Dude, here's the thing. That that treat him like shit, stick like whatever oh. the fuck you said. Yeah, that was that whole thing, thing was like, yo, you gotta be mean to him and they'll stick. Yeah. There are people that will it's so stupid. It's like they got and that's the yeah. person you don't want to fucking be yeah. with. Yeah. Because they have major insecurity issues. Oh. It's the worst. Oh. It's so uncomfortable. Treat me like shit, I need it. You look like shit. And I go, okay, I'm gonna go over here. Yeah. <laughs> fuck you and your weird hat. Yeah. yeah fuck. You unbelievable. I think, I yeah, my like, mom is like glued artist. to this shit. She was watching it all oh, day. Oh, that's so fun. She was watching it, it all day. And she was like, it's so funny. I go, oh, Mom, you're watching. Dude, they're getting big laughs in there. Have you heard <laughs> yes. about laughs? It's like yeah. a good room. They're like, it's like a fucking, it's like a multicam sitcom. Yeah. Can I yeah. open for the trial? <laughs> Dude, I'm telling Dude, you. Dude, crowd work. New York crowd warm up. Yeah. Okay, um, ladies and gentlemen of the jury, oh, you're going to have a warm a guy come in here and warm you guys up a little bit. Please welcome for the Lions In podcast, uh, Will Burkhart. <laughs> hey, guys. So my girlfriend's real. <laughs> you know <what> I mean? <laughs> Not dealing with that, though. Whoops. <laughs> Um, don't write all of it down. No, stop writing, stop writing, stop writing. <laughs> that weird fucking sonographer yeah. shit. How what, fast can they fucking type, Is that type, a language? Like, what is that? Because it's not like this. Well, it's the, it looks like the They're keyboard doing... is this big. They're like... Yeah. Yeah, but it's... It, hey, I by the way, we have technology. So let's just uh, have a voice call. I, I would do vo voice to text. I would just go, yeah. I'm just going to sit here. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Slow down. The voice, voice stenographer. But yeah. then you go got back. the people that, that need the... Oh, the, the sign language? Yeah. So what do you do with How do you that? Know? I didn't know you know sign language. Dude, I know so many languages. I don't understand everything you said. I know the language of signs. Wow. I know a little bit of Spanish. And I know the language of love, baby. <laughs> All right, let me just clean, clean this poop out of my bed and we'll get back to the love. <laughs> Jason Collins, did you or did you not say, I know the language of sign, yes. I know a little bit of Spanish, <laughs> and I know the language of love? Yes, but that is a very common language that everybody should know. <laughs> Basically, the language of love is this. <laughs> if your bodies are in tune. <laughs> I can't. And you're signing? <laughs> this is a very distracting doing, courtroom. I just want the dude, record you're doing to be shown. Shadow pets, what do you mean? No, bro. this is this is this is the courtroom. This is the courtroom. <laughs> what if that's how they that's did just sign? A they had a spotlight with a white wall. <laughs> <laughs> we got a rabbit going here. Hey. Yeah, just pretty do good, shadows. Good, pretty good. I got a dog so here. the dog shit on the bed. <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> and he had a, a mastery shit. of uh, bowel shit. issues. <laughs> you know, you know, bu bullshit is actually this yeah. 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 sign language. Yeah. That's fucking that awesome. Yes. And then, uh, you know what no is? What? Oh, yeah. <laughs> anyways. <laughs> and then watch this. She laughs at that. Ha 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 <laughs> I love that the keyboard got yeah. longer. You were going like this. Bing. <laughs> it's not my fault. The court, the court hasn't changed anything. Dude, what does stenography <laughs> look like on paper? You notice they're typing the shit out of it. There's like a paper going. It's yeah, electronic yeah. now, but it's like a ticket time. Where's that thing? A tick, like uh, a, a ticket. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't know words. Come ticket on. Taylor. Or Taylor. Ta ticker fuck tape. off, Brent. Just read. <laughs> ticker tape. <laughs> ticker tape. Yeah. yeah. Ticker court tape. Stenographer. <laughs> All right, let's see what this shit looks can't like. Spell that. Image. Mm -hmm. What does it fucking look yeah, like? Stenographer. Oh, look what it looks like. Let me see. 
this can't. Oh, how the hell can I? Anybody... We need to check the record, please. <laughs> Hold on. Wait, four so... four zeros in a row and a SKW. So yeah, the witness yeah. did test. Like what? Yeah. yeah. Real quick, Ooh. screenshot that though, and send it to Dave. That's insane. People have no idea what we just By saw. the way, I, I can will. do that job then. <laughs> Oh, oh, B B B D D B B D D D. Oh, 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 that's a good, that's a good point. W W W W W W. He's winning. L L L L W W L L W W L. I don't know. Apparently, it's a bunch of aliens. I'm gonna ran out of breath doing this bit. Oh god, looks so complicated for our listeners. It's so complicated. Look, Google Image is like stenographer. Dude, stenographers. I want to see a stenographer's hands. Is it like binded feet from Asian women? Huh? <laughs> you know what I'm talking about, right? They used to bind women's feet because they were too big back nope. in the day. That's not why they binded them. Did they really? No. The Asians. They yeah. Used to, well, don't, make it worse. Don't pluralize <laughs> it. But type in binded feet. Oh, do I have yeah. to? Yeah. Because yeah. it goes yeah. and ties their little tiny shoes. Because I got to get out of this. Binding <laughs> feet. Binding feet in China. Yeah. Why China? Uh, foot. 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 Oh, boy. Fine. Are you still stoned, too? Fuck. I read it and said foot. Look at the feet. They used to break women's feet to uh, fit. Foot binding or, f I mean, foot space binding wrong. or in foot China. binding was a Chinese custom of breaking and tightly binding the feet of young girls in order to change their shape and size. See? Feet altered by foot binding were known as lotus feet, and the shoes made for these feet were known as lotus shoes. See? Whoa. But it wasn't because they Whoa. were too big. Well, they wanted to make it prettier so it yeah. Jesus, dude. The feet look Horrendous. Yeah. So now, do you guys get my alt Who? joke me... about binded hands, <laughs> dude? That's <laughs> that was something I actually remember from high school. You somehow. nailed it. That <laughs> is. Are you so proud of me, mom? Scary teacher. Fuck binded me. feet. I just remember being freaked out by that. Yeah, that's really Weird, scary looking. Dude. And really they, really they walk around. They're like, yeah. Oh man, I don't think that's <laughs> what they fucking do. Dude, you can't. I can't get in trouble with this. I'm. I just did a, the crazy woke Asian podcast. So. Mm. I was a special guest on there. You talk about oh. th that with them too. Mm -hmm. Binding feet. <laughs> it's amazing that we just blow past binded feet. They always let that be. It's a thing. amazing a lot of things that we blow, blow past yeah. these days. Oh. And then you can just. That's fucking weird. Do we have any emails? We do. We have a let's 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 wrap. We'll we'll end with this because where are we at on time? A, we're forty seven minutes. Nice. <laughs> so we have uh, we have a, a Patreon message here, which is kind of like a dating advice update thing. Mm. Uh, this is from a we Mufasa member, we so we have to prioritize. We didn't ruin another relationship, right? I don't know. Oh, okay. Uh, this is from Cynthia, and again, she's a Mufasa member, so she's the shit. We got to give her major props. But I do want. I like that we're doing it on the regular episode. Yes, yeah. we this want. Is, yes, this is a this is a good update. So. Uh, I think it sounds like back in the day she was kind of getting dating advice from us. No. Um, it looks like she was like um, uh, asking just kind of like I'm trying to, I'm like scrolling back up to see uh, J Jason's brilliant advice of make an OnlyFans page. Um, <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> and things you forget you say. <laughs> I want to one yeah. day see the course stenographer go like this. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Jesus. <laughs> she said uh, she was like, how to date people during COVID. We mm. talked about it then. Mm. Uh, she was also the one she worked in. I remember this. In an operating room, and her, I think her AirPods came out, and the pod went on the Alexa and played for like the operating room, and something we all, something you guys said. Oh, that's right. It, it, it was, <laughs> we were getting, oh, no, it, and it said, make an OnlyFans page. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, no. So, we got an I'll show, I'm worried about that patient. She's listening to us during a surgery. <laughs> oh, I know. God. We're just like fucking poopy jokes mm. and fucking little curvy penises. <laughs> All right, little curvy penises. What an asshole! Now, Sorry. all right, Ugh. um, it's not okay. little. Okay, and curved. It's not curved. Yeah, 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 <sighs> yeah. It's not curved. It's a little curved. A little curved. Yeah. Um, <laughs> so hey, fellas, it's been some time since I last wrote in, but I've been loyally listening. It's been almost a year since I last wrote into the pod seeking dating advice, so I thought I'd give y'all an update. Mm. Update. Engaged. What? Wow. How did I meet him? My friends and I stumble. Only fans. My stumble. Yeah, right. Only fans. My big, my best subscriber. Oh, maybe. My friends and I stumbled out of an Uber at her apartment, a little tipsy, after a few mm -hmm. drinks one night. Mm -hmm. As we made our way to the to her door, I somehow lost my footing and fell into the bushes in front of her terrace. Funny. Wow. She apparently didn't even notice because she left her door open and proceeded to pass out in her living room while oh, I yeah. struggled to get a out of the. A few drinks. Yeah, a few. A little tipsy. <laughs> you fell into some shrubs. 
<laughs> um, wow. So she so struggled to get out <laughs> like this. Well, I struggled to get out of the very sharp bush slash shrub. Don't know the difference. <laughs> Lucky for me, her next door neighbor witnessed this disaster and was kind enough to help me out of the bushes and back on my feet. <laughs> That's the girl for me. <laughs> the next morning, I ran into her next door neighbor again while I was on my way out. He was on his way to the gym, but ended up inviting me to breakfast instead. <gasps> wow. Wow. Fast forward to March. He's like, this girl's fun. Yeah. So this is, I'm trying to get, she said to March. I don't know when, yeah, like fast forward it. to when. We're in Costa Rica and just got back to our Airbnb after hiking for four hours and driving for three hours. Her and the neighbor guy? Yeah. All while having a terrible sunburn and I fell in the pool that was outside our air room. She's falling a lot. He asked me to marry him right then and there. I love a girl with wow. an inner ear disease. He said... <laughs> I love a girl who can't and doesn't have equilibrium. <laughs> he said he had a special... If you fall one more time, I'm going to fall even harder, baby. <laughs> He said he had a special proposal planned, but couldn't miss the opportunity. Oh, because oh, wow. it kind of called back to her falling in the beginning? Yeah. I think that's what it was. That's kind of sweet. That guy's wow. sentimental. That's really adorable. Yeah. Wow. Well, what do we have to do with this? So what did, how did we help Well, I think that? she's given us an update, because I think we gave her dating advice way back oh. when, and now she's so engaged. The, our advice didn't work. OnlyFans doesn't work. Okay, yeah. guys, out there, if you're single, get shit-faced drunk, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Make sure that your girlfriend has a hot neighbor mm -hmm. and fall in the fucking bushes in front of him. Yeah. yeah. And guess where you're going tomorrow morning? Breakfast instead of the gym. Mm -hmm. And then fast forward to March. Yep. Costa Rica, Costa Rica, almost drowned. He thinks it's adorable. You're getting married. married. And then you fall into that bed on the honeymoon. Yeah. And then uh, give me another falling bit. <laughs> <laughs> and then his penis falls into your vagina. Yeah, you know, talk about baby it. falls out of that vagina. <laughs> <laughs> talk about a bush. <laughs> <laughs> Wee. Nice. Congratulations. Congrats, that's Cynthia. Awesome. That's so awesome. happy that story. you did not listen to any of our advice and you figured it out yourself. That's yeah. amazing, though. But and thank you for the update. We actually, we love that. Yeah. Any Mufasa members, just so you know, like, also, we I spent the weekend with a lot of Fufasa. Fufa. I knew I was going to do Mufasa. that by dyslexia. But uh, we spent the weekend hanging with you guys. You yeah, were awesome as shit. Shout I out love everybody. a good origin story. And this, yeah. is an, this is a story in years from now. When your grandkids or your kids go, how did you and dad meet? Yeah. Your dad's going to be like, honey, I got this. It's a work. Your mom's story. a fucking klutz. Okay? <laughs> She's a lush, a klutz. She's a drunk. God damn She's a klutz. It, <laughs> is she adorable? <laughs> yeah. Really that a great really story. Is, those are the sweet ones I like. Yeah. That's, that's so cool. Thanks, Cynthia. That's a great story. Yeah. Please send us more dating stories. We love them. Please yeah. send more of those. Beautiful. Pay, Patreon email, podthelinesden at gmail.com. Send those fucking dating yeah. emails because they're great. And send the dating ones because I've just started dating again. And it, he doesn't know how. So and, he needs well, to I forgot how. I used to be really good at it. But I'm So I'll share mine if you share yours. So, Ooh, okay. I like Boom. that. I like the offer. I like yeah. that. Um, well, before we go, we, wanna do, we need to do dates. Plug some dates. Oh, Plug shit. some dates. Well, all right. We'll, we'll be well, in Addison, all three of us. Yep. But Addison Improv yeah. Dallas. When you see this, this weekend will be Addison. I'll mm -hmm. be at Netflix Fest. Uh, 28. Two gigs. Uh, no, it's two different shows now, but just doing uh, spots uh, sometime in May. Towards uh, the end of May. Uh, How long is that fucking festival? I think it's. I I didn't think it started yet. Did it? It starts like like next. I think it's two weeks. It starts the first two weeks of May. Yeah. Yeah. So sometime then it will be on my website. I'm Brent's agent. <laughs> It doesn't so matter. if you're watching this, the the dates for Dallas, we're going to be at the Addison Improv, Dallas, Texas, and those dates are 29th to the first, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Yeah. So come see us. Yeah. So we'll fuck all, rent, and come see us. We'll all be there. May, It'll be a party. <laughs> May 11th, I will be in mm. La Jolla at the Comedy Store. Awesome. Uh, May 15th, I will be headlining the Irvine Improv on May 15th. That's a seven o'clock show. So we got some awesome. stuff coming up, kids. All right, let's go hang out on Patreon. You want to? Nice. Let's yeah. do it. Let's go talk about. Bands. Oh, and also, also uh, uh, San Jose. That's up in July. Oh, it is. Yeah. Okay, in what, July. What are the dates? Uh, 29th, 30th, and 31st of July. End Beautiful. of July. Beautiful. Is that driving distance? San Jose? No. It's in. No. Okay. No. Good try though. But. It's a, driving from where I live. From where I, I got what you're doing. I'm used to Connecticut. It's just one it's stone throw distance? away from everywhere. San Jose is kind of like it's like flying to San Fran. Okay. It's like an hour away from yeah, the city. Sweet. Can't, Can't wait. wait. That will be fun. Yeah, yeah, get out there, time. kids. July once again. 29th, 30th, 31st. July 29th, 30th, 31st. We will be at the San Jose Improv, and I'm very much looking forward to that. That's a great club. Never, Never done it. Been. Great. Oh, it's beautiful, dude. Beautiful awesome. theater. Awesome. Yep. All right, kids. We'll see you on the Patreon. We're gonna go swear and talk about sex. Bye. <laughs> we did that here. <laughs> Digging each other.